Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Sambhu from Cloud Tech. This is the continuous session from previous session. Now in this session, yeah, if you would like to revoke any permission or any particular set of uh, like permission or if you would like to delete this uh, SSO or if you would like to disable this SSO, that how we can do that I will show you in this video. Okay guys. So in my previous session, if you see here, this particular, uh, I have logged in already one user, right? So this SSO user have only three accounts. So let me show you if I would like to remove one account, then how we can do that. Okay. Suppose let's go to here and let's go to this permission set and if you want to remove this permission right suppose i am remove this or if you want to update also that also you can do so let's type this confirmation here now this is removed so let me show you that now see it was 3 was there now it is a 2 right so 1 i have already revoked so similar way we can revoke and if you would like to delete anything suppose this sso you want to disable how we can do let's go to the settings before that let me show you how we can clean up this uh, user groups also so let's go to the user and suppose this user i want to delete so just click on delete groups and here we have to type that confirmation message like uh, what the groups you are going to delete so that group name we have to type so you can delete these groups also and if you would like to delete user also let's select this user and delete this user okay guys now if you want to uh, remove this permission set also that also you can do how we can do let me show you that let's go to here select this and delete this permission this permission and the billing set okay so, so let's go to the aws account and let's select this Sunset administrative access only. Let's uh, go to here permission set. Nothing is there. I have selected that permission set in this this one, right? So let's select this one and remove this. So what we have to type here delete. Then only you can delete that permission set. Let me show you that. Now let's go to the permission set. Now you can able to read. So that point also keep in mind, guys. If you have already assigned this permission to a particular account. Then first you have to uh, deselect from that account then only you can delete from now you can delete so remove it from there so still it is session is there even though we removed so it will take some time so it is taking time now you can delete now delete is done now if you want to disable this I am itself, so how we can do, let's go to the settings and guys and keep in mind corresponding whatever permission we have created right, corresponding I am role also it is created, so let me show you that. Go to the roles and you can see this SSO role is created right and here set of permission also it is there bunch of permission is there okay guys that point also keep in mind so now if you want to uh, like uh, remove this im center itself right so let me show you before that one thing here uh, let's go to the uh, im center okay now i am in the virginia region okay so let me uh, switch to define region first suppose i am going to oregon And now let's try to enable that SSO here. Okay, let's go to here. I was talking about it. It's a global. So once you enable, right? If you are see, this I am already enabled to this Virginia region. Since it is already enabled from in, from the Virginia region, you cannot enable to other region. It's a global kind of thing. Okay, guys. So that's point also keep in mind. So now how we can delete this? So let's go to the management here. And here one option we have delete this IAM configuration. Once you delete, right? So let me show you that. So let's select all and let's give this number confirmation number and then delete. Okay. Now here it is enabled. So let me go to this. Here it was like this, right? So let's refresh it. Now that option is given. So this is how we can enable and disable also, guys. Okay, guys, that point also keep in mind. 
I hope uh, you guys clearly understood how we can revoke that particular user groups or maybe if you want to remove from uh, now uh, what happened now we disable right so if you refresh this right so now this is gone so this is how we can do so I hope this session will be helpful to you guys and if you feel this video is valuable then please like and subscribe my channel and share surrounding with your friend that will really inspire to me that will really motivate to me to create such kind of content and I will come in my next subsequent video like external IDP like Azure AD. Azure AD I have already demonstrated like how we can configure Azure AD all these things. So you guys can have refer that video. But uh, next video I will come up like Azure AD as a like external IDP like how we can use. Now here we use like AWS organize uh, like uh, inside the AWS organization only we have done right. So next video I will show you Azure AD how we can configure the SSO. Okay guys. Shallow. Bye. See you in my next video.